So I got a question from Sub Artist. Um, so they asked, well, now that you've been a pharmacist now, uh, how do you like your job? So after reflecting on the past year and a half since I've been licensed, you know, I've worked in long-term care pharmacy and inpatient hospital pharmacy, both staffing uh, for the most part. But in the long-term care setting, I do some clinical work, uh, at, you know, monitoring Vanco, Gent, you know, Amikacin, uh, TPNs, you know, the, the standard typical things. Um, not nothing too difficult per se. Uh, and then I get some consult questions from doctors every so often that I have to look up information. But for the most part, you know, it's mainly staffing. Uh, you know, uh, checking and distribution type of work. You know, after a year and a half now, I've, I've gained a, quite a bit of experience. You know, I feel very comfortable in both settings. You know, uh, I feel like I've learned almost as much as I can learn at this point. And the main thing, if I wanted to kind of grow from here, would be either kind of the management pathway, uh, consultant pharmacist pathway, or maybe thinking about expanding my knowledge and skills in the IT realm, or even maybe thinking about a residency, but at this point, getting a residency would be very difficult for uh, a person like me because I'm not a recent graduate anymore. Uh, but it still is a possibility. Um, so, you know, after graduating, you know, I, it's it's been nice. I've learned a lot. I've, I've met a lot of people. And, you know, it's, I have to say, it's much better earning money than paying money for tuition. You know, it's not all about the money. It's also about, you know, your life satisfaction and what you do and things like that. And, you know, I've gotten into other hobbies such as videography, as I mentioned in the past in my uh, other video for weddings, you know, it's, it's kind of a hobby for fun. Uh, you know, I'm also thinking about traveling more uh, and then maybe I'll think about, you know, working harder on my own career. But at this point, I'm pretty satisfied. I kind of want to enjoy life a little bit. Uh, and that's just me and that my personal, you know, uh, goals at this point. You know, things can change. And maybe even possibly going back to school for, you know, if I want to pursue management, maybe an MBA or something along those lines. Uh, and even, you know, I haven't had the chance to really precept students so much, but that's also fairly rewarding. I've done that a little bit here and there in the past year and a half, but, you know, maybe I can get into starting up a program at the long-term care uh, is one of my goals, I guess. So, yeah, that's kind of my reflection on my first year as a pharmacist, but a year and a half. But since I've been working so much, I'm about experience-wise two years uh, because I've been doing like 50, 60 hours a week for a year and a half. All right, so thanks for watching, and remember, eat your vegetables.